Hi, this is Dave Aquino from MicroQuant. This is the Value Charts video of the day for Tuesday, uh, June 25th, 2013. The, uh, what I'd like to show you in the video of today is a chart of MasterCard on a, on a daily time frame here. You can see what's happened over the past three, two to three trading days. MasterCard has fallen off. Uh, yesterday we actually had a significantly undervalued level and we actually touched this 55710 uh, level that corresponds to the lows on this day and then this day. Uh, we did bounce off that level and today we're actually uh, bouncing nicely. This is still an inside day compared to yesterday but we do have some uh, strengthening to the upside. Uh, we have decreasing bearish momentum. Now, the strategy that we're actually starting to look at on Tuesdays and then even on Wednesdays, starting to look at opportunities to write credit spreads. This is where we collect the premium on a spread and we look for the price to stay away from the short strike. In this particular case, we wrote the credit spread. It is a uh, call credit spread with the short leg being at 580. We've done this uh, several times in MasterCard and have been quite successful. Now, this uh, crisscross pattern of all these trend lines and support levels actually uh, stem back, going back a couple of weeks. There was a pennant pattern in which MasterCard broke through the bottom. We were able to write uh, credit spreads at 590, 580 as prices were moving down. What was neat was last week uh, when we rebounded here, we actually wrote a put credit spread so we profited when the prices moved away from the short strike which was down here uh, towards uh, 560 five, uh, actually it was 555 so when we got far enough away we actually bought them back uh, cheaper and then we wrote a credit spread when prices started falling at the end of the week so MasterCard we double dipped we, uh, we earned a lot of money in credit spreads last week so this week we're looking to do the same we've come down here we've bounced now this bounce actually gives us the opportunity to uh, collect a little bit more in terms of credit spread. So uh, right now the uh, MasterCard credit spread we received $0.28 cents or $28 per contract and we did that for 10 contracts. Now what uh, we were actually watching it to do is if we come back a little bit closer, we're watching momentum and in indicator line, uh, also watching economic reports and, and see how it behaves in response to that. Uh, we're actually seeing that the indicator line is still negative, histogram is still red. So we have a downward outlook, a, a bearish outlook on MasterCard. That's why we wrote the credit spread. If things change, uh, we could uh, adjust this. Uh, or or if, if it looks like it's going to persist and just go sideways, we can add some more to this credit spread if it looks like things are going to be moving our way. Because it is only Tuesday, but then Wednesday and Thursday we can make adjustments on it. So, again, this is Dave Aquino with, uh, with uh, MicroQuant. Thank you. Never miss a value charts trade. Go ahead and subscribe to this YouTube channel to see more Trade of the Day videos. Click it now. Again, this is Dave Aquino reminding you to keep your options open and your trades profitable.